little quick gym session this morning. Got me with later, so just banged out a bit of chest, a bit of cross trainer work, and some shoulders. Happy days. So that was it, got the early workout done, purely just chest and shoulders, a little bit of pull up work as well, just for a good measure. Protein shake, skipping the breakfast down here today because I've got a meeting with my good mate, Phil Parkinson, a good old friend of mine from the UK. He's out here, he's running things called the Circuit Factory, which is a very, very, very successful circuit class in, in Dubai, which is uh, which is really, really good. He's brought sort of a lot of good nutrition sort of angle to what he's doing and everything else. Brought out some good fun challenges and just launched uh, Circuit Factory Kids as well. So, but this kind of area I've never been to before, so it's quite nice, quite exciting to see a bit of the, the Dubai rather than just the sites that I'd normally sort of see, like the malls. But anyway, so we're going to go down and see Phil and see what he's got to say. We got him! Oh. <laughs> the most wanted. The G5X one, have you? Have you ever got a dead cat? Let's see. How's it going? The micro mark. Has it got the screen that comes out? Yeah. So you can it. see you in it. Oh, it's a perfect vlogging camera. Yeah, yeah. Wow, Check someone's come a long phone. way. You must have a good looking teacher. How's it going? I'm good, mate. You? Mm, we're good. Okay, go. This is the man. We're going to have a conversation right now. There we go. We're going to have a conversation. Am I going to be in the Soul Gilbert blog? I think we've got it, really. I mean. fucking well better be. I hope <laughs> fucking bad language isn't wrong, you cunts out there. Beep, beep, beep. Back in a bit. Check this out. Why? Stuck this in a car the park. Last ever Soul Gilbert blog. I'm gonna <laughs> bury him. I'm gonna bury him under this thing. I have got a clue what is going on now. Why? Right? I am in the dark in sunny Dubai. Work that one out. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen it in the Apple Store. It shoots. Uh, it shoots 4K at 60p, which is basically the finest video that you're going to get at the moment. And. Uh, it shoots 120 frames a second, super slow motion. Steady as a rock. Let's see. It's a bit of a bastard for built up areas though, mate, eh? Yeah, it's not. Well, I did crash the first one I got. <laughs> How much are they? This one's $2,000. $2,000? Yeah. This one is a beast, but for the picture, I'm not sure about the, uh, the AR, whatever, whatever your one yours, but this one here is a is a really good drone. Like, this will revolutionise your vlogging. We're going to test the sensors now. We're going to quite sensibly fly the drone at 30 miles an hour straight at us and hopefully the sensor will kick in, so stay tuned. We'll back it up to get a bit of... Okay, straight up on the gear stick. <laughs> Good luck. It's going to stop. It's going to stop. There we go. It did. Yeah, Pete days. That's the result. Let me try that again, see if it really works. Can we come? <laughs> it's coming in. Uncrackable. <laughs> well, guys and girls, that's the DJI Phantom. It's a weapon. It is. We're going to get one for the gym. The footage today. Yeah. You're dead in a week. Yeah. Let, now, a week, in, in six months' time, you can yeah. pull back anything you want. Training footage. Yep. Yeah. Uh, time lapses. Cool. Always, you know, all of your time lapses in one, in one, just bang, they're there. Yeah. Everything. That was a really good inspirational meeting from Phil. He really does know his stuff, do you know what I mean, when it boils down to the uh, editing side of things. And that DJI Phantom's a weapon, as you would probably agree. I'm just going to go down to the beach now and put Boston and Jersey for a little running session. Get out in the sunshine, get that vitamin D on the film. Check it out. <laughs>